We have a brand new update on MLB The Show 22. It is August 9th, and this is one of the biggest updates that I've been waiting for. It was on my wish list for uh, the game this year, and I was thinking we'd have to wait until next year, but we have it here right now. Um, the update just dropped, so we're going to get a first look at the new props that just came out. In the update, they said there are... 89 new minor league theme props and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our props here zoom out I'm actually gonna go over here with it and I'm gonna put all the props out so we can get a look at them and what you do is when you uh, go into props hold R1 go to search and we're gonna search minor league kit all in one word so we're gonna hit done here r2 and it says no results found so what i figured out is you hold r1 go over to search by tag and then go down here and minor league kit is there so we hit select then we hit confirm which is the square button and then we get our new props here. So we have a, a white wood bench to start. We have another bench here. A new bridge. This is a big one here. This helps with a lot of different builds. So we'll put that there. We have another new church, a smaller one. I like that a lot. Little uh, clock mini clock tower a lot of uh, real good builds so far with these new additions another tower there they're calling this the college student union cool little building another uh, building here little apartment building Another condo, they're calling it. Now, this is a big addition here. Little harbor. Little marina. A lot of uh, good builds with that. Very helpful. A smaller dock. We have an aquarium. So far, huge win for Stadium Creator. Really excited to get into these builds. It'll probably be a few days before I can do my next one. With uh, the Field of Dreams game being today. That I'll be going to. By the way, uh, be on the lookout for a video for that also coming up. This is a drop tower it's called. Entertainment Drop Tower. This is that ride where they drop you from the top that I would never go on myself. We have a Ferris wheel, huge addition right here. I've been wanting this for a real long time. <laughs> I cannot wait to use this. I can already think of uh, the first build I want to do with that is going to be uh, the Quad Cities, which has that in left field. We have an outlet mall. We have Performing Arts, another smaller building. This next one is Entertainment Pirates. Pirate Ship, big win there for the pirate fans or Sea of Thieves players, Sea of Thieves players. We got a little mini playground. We have mini golf. The Pirate's Cove is now here on MLB The Show. This is a horse racing track. That's interesting. It's got the stables in the back there. Could do a few things with that. This is another one of those type of rides that you would never get me to go on. This is a good one here. Gray Barn smaller barn than the ones that we have already we have a new billboard here 
We have a little uh, state capital looking building. Huge addition so far. I love it, great update so far. This is huge right here, by the way. Grass ramp, I can already see how I could try and use these as a berm. And the other big thing about it is it has a little uh, slant to it there which helps to build it up. It can also be used as a pitcher's mound for a bullpen, like a custom bullpen. <clears throat> and not only that, but they gave us curve pieces for it too. This is huge. This is probably the biggest thing so far. We have curved pieces, we have long pieces. This makes it where you can make your own grass berm Huge game changer. We have bushes. You can do a lot with that as well. This right here is the embassy suites that you would see. Uh, maybe not. I was going to say in Frisco, but uh, I think this is something different than that. Let's see what this one is. This is a smaller hotel here. Helps with some other uh, themes that you may want to do. This is a cool looking uh, building. I know some people are doing like casino themed stadiums and things. Uh, this may be good for that. We have another smaller hotel. We have another little uh, subdivision here. Good addition there. Helps with our uh, outside buildings that we want to do. Another house there. Here's a little uh, shipping container. Can be used for uh, other things as well. And we are at 99%. So I'm going to have to delete a few items here. Before I do that, I will take a little screenshot. The other big thing about this is that uh, our Ferris wheel here moves. It's animated. So this is the first uh, batch of items here. Let me get a little screenshot here for the thumbnail. And we'll take out a few things here and see what uh, kind of room we have. That right there took about 20-30% already. So one thing I can say about these items, some of them are going to be a little more taxing on your space. So plan accordingly. Alright, so we're going back in here. We're going to search by tag. We're going to go down here to minor league kit again. Confirm. And we were at, actually, why don't we just do it this way? We select this house here. That worked. Let me make sure though. We want to go down here and search by our tag still. Oops. Rookie mistakes being made. By the way, due to the timing of this video, with it being, uh, 6 a.m. before I'm going to the game later today. I will not be editing things and it's just going to go right on. Direct upload. Okay, so here's where we were. We had our containers. We have a green container. We have an orange one. We have a red one. So this is cool, like for a, a shipyard or a, um, some type of harbor. We got a few different things here. We have cranes. This is animated. There's also a large crane. Oops. Got to go back in again. I accidentally uh, selected it. We'll go to our large crane here.
We have an industrial manufacturing building. Not really sure exactly what this would be, but could probably go with the farm theme also. <coughs> Small office here. Kind of like the trailer offices at a construction site. This is a big warehouse. This is your Amazon warehouse right here. Next day delivery. Little warehouse. This was the sign that I saw earlier. It says open 24 hours on it. I'm sure it probably lights up. I'm sure that Ferris wheel lights up as well. I didn't check it. Another unique building there. This is a nice addition as well. These buildings will be real nice for uh, like uh, medium sized cities that you're wanting to create your own buildings on your own. This would be interesting to see how to uh, use it. Another one to go with it. A third one as well. Another parking garage. <clears throat> An additional one, this one says college. And this is what we've all been wanting. A parking lot where we don't have to sink the parking garage in. We now have our own parking lot. There's another one as well. Pretty soon here I'm probably going to have to uh, delete a bunch of items again. We're at 97%. So we'll go ahead real quick here. I'm sure the Amazon building took up some space as well. The biggest thing I noticed so far in this update would be the uh, amount of space that these things take up. But when you're dealing with large buildings and animated things, that is uh, to be expected. So we're down to 58% now. We should have enough for the rest of them. We'll go into Minor League Kit again. And we'll scroll all the way to where we were. Huge win for Stadium Creators today. Can't wait to see what uh, everyone makes with the new props. This was definitely on my wish list uh, for this year. Another thing, um, this looks more like a bus stop or something it would be with the arrows there. Be interesting to see what it connects with here. This is just a plain lot. I thought it would be uh, connected, maybe connected with this. So it looks like just a regular parking lot that connects to this. We have a little pond here. Maybe nice to add. Uh, we'll have to see what else we have to go with it. This is the first uh, type of uh, thing with water besides that fountain that we have though. And more... Uh, We'll have to see how it could be used. Smaller school there. Little shop building there. This is a skyscraper. I can't really get it zoomed out enough to get the whole building here. I can't even get to the top of that. So that's going to be a, a big building there. Needed a couple more of those to mix things up. Another skyscraper here.
We got a little radio tower, big radio tower. And I'm completely zoomed out right now, by the way, in the distance. So some of this stuff you won't even be able to see the top of. Small radio tower there. Another smaller one. Little trolley station. I can already think of the Verdansk train station. I would have used that for the fire station. We have a silo. I may have to go back and uh, modify some of my builds that I've done so far with these new props. Little uh, barrier there. Not really sure. Oh, okay. These are uh, beams like what you'd see at a construction site. We have a hospital building here. We're up to 93% again. Little orange uh, barrier there. Parking roof. Could have uh, multiple uses. Little utility station. A smokehouse. We're up to 99% again. So we'll uh, take some more of these down. These big buildings. Those weren't too bad on uh, percentage wise. Huge update. Love it so far. I thought we were going to have a few additional uh, ballpark items and call it good. This is all mainly uh, focused on scenery that I've seen so far. The other stuff may be there still. I'm going to go ahead and go to our tag again still. There we go. We'll get back to our spot here. That was new. Okay, so we had these solar panels. Stone separator. The biggest thing so far, in my opinion, has to be the uh, grass berm still. So on this separator, the stone separator here, first thing I can think of are the fountains and uh, that we could use this to make it look more natural as a fountain compared to signs or whatever to cover it up. Here's our cargo ship to help with our theme of uh, harbor possibly. We have a dump truck for a construction theme. All kinds of equipment here. And there it is. I was just mentioning it about the water. Now we can create riverfront stadiums. This is huge right here. This was something that we'd have to use the beach scene and cover it up before. We now have a huge win. And that's not the only one. We have this also. Huge win right here. I cannot wait to use uh, all this different stuff. And then we are back to the start. So all in all, I would say this is a huge win for stadium creators. Can't wait to see how you guys use it. Um, let me know in the comments what you think of the new props. And thanks for checking out the video. And make sure to be on the lookout for my next video, which will be from the Field of Dreams game. Uh, that is later tonight.